make it a wonderful Tuesday. Now today, we're also continuing our weather work series. And this week we're talking about something called topography. You probably learned it in school and then quickly forgot it. Well, topography is things like hills and mountains and flatlands and creeks, and they do have an impact on our weather, like things like afternoon storms and how hot we're going to be. So this week, meteorologist Taylor Stephenson explains topography in this week's episode of Weather Works. I'm meteorologist Taylor Stephenson here to explain to you how your weather works. First, let's define what topography is. According to the Oxford Dictionary, topography is the arrangement of different natural or man-made features in an area. For example, a lake or a building are both considered to be topography. Elevation is also a part of an area's topography. Hyperlocally in Perry, Georgia, the elevation above sea level for the city is only 364 feet. Macon's elevation is 381 feet, while Atlanta's elevation is much higher at 1,050 feet. Places with lower elevations like Perry and Macon will usually have warmer air temperatures than higher elevation cities like Atlanta. As height increases, the air pressure drops. As air pressure drops, this also allows the air temperatures to drop as well. This is particularly important with the summer afternoon showers and storms. To get those storms going, there needs to be enough heat energy during the hottest parts of the day. Lower lying areas can see more storms during the summer because the air temperatures are hotter. Moving north through Georgia, you reach the Appalachian Mountains. Mountainous terrain can create their own clouds. As moist air is forced to rise on the windward side of the mountain, it cools and condenses. This cooled condensed air makes what we call orographic clouds. On the other side of the mountain, the air sinks and becomes dry. This is why the windward side of mountains is much greener and humid than the leeward side. So that's how topography affects the weather. I'm meteorologist Taylor Stephenson, and that's how your weather works. I love these segments so much. They're so much fun. Maybe it's just the uh, weather nerd in me. Well, if you have any questions on weather phenomena and why they work, you can email us at news at 13wmaz.com or find the WeatherWorks post on our Facebook page. And your question just might be our next WeatherWorks topic. We'll be right back. 